It was like he ran the route for him for the big interception there. Intercepted right into the hands of Desmond King. The junior out of Detroit will take it to the house. Another member of our all-decade football team, former Iowa corner Desmond King, NFL All-Pro, joining us now. Uh, hey, Des, let's start with this. Uh, your thoughts on being named one of just two corners to make the all-decade team? That's an amazing accomplishment. Uh, I really appreciate, you know, everyone that, you know, put me in that category as being, you know, one of the great cornerbacks of the decade. Um, that it means a lot, honestly. Hey, so let me ask, was it your idea or was it the coach's idea to also utilize you on special teams? It was really my idea. I've been trying to, like, play offense ever since I've been in college because um, I was a running back in high school and I played DB. So I got recruited as an athlete when I got to Iowa. They didn't know whether which side I was going to play on offense or defense. Um, it, it, it became defense. And then uh, I told coach I got a little offensive background inside of me you know I hopefully I can get a chance you know catching like punts and kick returns he was like well let, we, we give you a shot let's see what you can do with it and I remember in practice literally the first punt return that kicked me I scored a touchdown on it and then that's when it you know I just had the position at the whole thing able to make an impact on a couple of different ways but you're best known for your work in the defensive backfield. As I kind of peek over your right shoulder there, is that the Thorpe Award hiding in the background? <laughs> yeah, that, that, that's him up there. That's the Thorpe Trophy. I, can't, I keep that with me. Um, my mom has one, Iowa has one, and it's one and down in Oklahoma at the Hall of Fame building. Yeah, do you remember uh, what the feeling was when you heard that Desmond King was the winner of the Thorpe Award that year? It, it, I was pretty shocked. Uh, <laughs> Because me and Vernon, me and Vernon Hargraves, we're like really good friends. We met actually in high school playing a uh, seven on seven traveling um, team. Uh, we played his team versus mine. We traveled down to Florida and we played those guys. So that's when I first actually met him. And then, you know, we've been cool since, you know, high school, college, and then now in the league. So I was pretty shocked. And he was like one of the top corners in the country that year. So, I mean, once I heard my name called, it was, was like, this is like really surreal. And I just didn't, didn't really believe it at first until I walked on the stage. I was like, okay, all right, <laughs> it's hitting me now. After that season, a lot of projections were expecting you to be either a first or second round pick if you decided to forego your senior season. Now you decided to come back and your stats weren't as good, but it wasn't really your fault. It was because nobody would throw to your side of the field. And he ended up going in the fifth round, I believe, to the Chargers. So was there ever a moment where you wondered if you had made the right decision coming back for that senior season? There were times where I was just, you know, thinking, uh, like, what if, what would what where I've been at right now in, in, in my life if I would have came out early? And I really couldn't determine that. So I was just thinking to myself, like, I wouldn't be in a position that I am right now if I did not go back for my senior year and uh, learn how to become a more efficient leader and just to get more knowledge into being NFL league ready. And I think that's where I'm at now. Like, I feel like I'm in a really good position um, in the NFL where I, I know knowledge, I know um, plays and our dissect stuff and just having that impact in the game and being a leader as well. Well, Des, uh, first and foremost, congratulations on being named to the All-Decade team, most certainly deserving after an outstanding Iowa career. And we know you're off to a great start in the NFL with the Chargers as well. So we wish you continued luck. We appreciate you spending some time with us today. For having me.